What do you think he does when he's not making music? He Who whittles. Did? He gave me a little rocking horse for my son. And I think he, he, he also whittled me a bear playing drums. <laughs> it's like this big, a little bear, and it's got little little sticks in there for the sticks and the, the bear smiling and hitting little metal things that are symbols. It's brilliant. He writes, he, he cans vegetables, he grows in his garden, he writes songs. I mean, and he plays, you know, he tours quite a bit. <laughs> There's no there's no punching the clock or, or phoning it in with Malcolm because he'll he'll leave you behind. You'll play over a bar and yeah, you, you sort of have you have to pay attention but you also have to just be in the moment. And you really have to be in the moment. How many shows have never How many hearts do you have to cry? And it would It's It's heavy, man. You know, there are a lot of people living life that aren't superstars, that aren't you know, maybe it's an everyday life, but that everyday life can be a hard existence. And I think Malcolm's great at delivering that guy's voice. Hey Malcolm, what's, what song are you guys going to start with? I don't have one here. No. Where he looks like a guy that wouldn't be, that wouldn't have attention to detail, but then he does his song and it's like, it's pretty detailed, they're, compl they're not, they're, they're really well developed constructed songs. Absolutely. One verse can be in three, you know, a bar of three, the other verse is in four. And 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 this is it's great you say that because what Malcolm does is he lets the lyrics he may write the music first, I don't know. But he lets the lyrics decide where the music goes. Instead of the other way around. A lot of writers I know and musicians, they're like, and these are the chords and I'll put the words around it. So if it's a bar of three in two verses and not in three others, so be it. And that's the deal where you gotta sort of be on the ball if you're playing with Malcolm. And you know, from rehearsal, we'll iron stuff out. We only rehearsed once and we ironed some stuff out. And then when we get in there, it might be Malcolm saying, you know, but I don't really like that verse or I don't want that solo there. You change on the dime, it's what you do as studio musicians anyway. But I love the way Malcolm doesn't let song structure or form be the doctrine. It's it's. This is a bar three here because this word jumps, and then we go back to the bar four. You know, when you're reading it, it, it gets a little. You know, you kind of want to just play, which which I always wind up doing. I, I rely on Dave for that reading part. <laughs> He's the translator. I was a cook at the Bluebird cafe here in town and uh, he was playing one night and we kind of had a funny meeting but we just kind of were kindred pretty quick there. A few months later I set in with him just on a couple songs and then we tried a few th other, other things out and went on a tour together and uh, been playing on and off with him since about 99. <laughs> about 1999 I believe uh, 100, 100 Lies came out, Malcolm's Geffen record, and I got a, a original copy that said Geffen Records. It was, I think, it was a, um, a promotion or a pre-release copy, and I listened to that over and over and over. I couldn't get enough of it. It's all about the song. Period. Just him telling the story, and we try to just get out of the way of that. And do you think that's what's kept you interested in playing? And and you know what I mean? Like, do you think you would have burned out on any other kind of act? Is that what keeps you in? in? Oh, I think um, that's a heavy question. I think you got a point there. <laughs> that, I mean, I think your answer is in your question. I think I would have been wore out by, uh, you know, top 40 pop stuff. Malcolm keeps you on your toes. We, Dave and I were talking about this yesterday. We were talking with Malcolm. We said, the fact that we can play with you and somewhat make sense of it, we can play with anyone <laughs> so I think that's true 
because um, he's he's one of the most unique and 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 syncopated and and uh, rhythmically interesting singer songwriters out there in my opinion i mean both lyrically melodically rhythmically everything and just um, one of the best poets of our time in my humble opinion you know he's as good as it gets when he's gone there won't be another one i'm sure of that it used to be the east side They drug me down too far I wallowed in my bad moods Hollered in the dark Spent all my time dying and losing Every single thought of a precious time. Hang on, hang on, I'm hearing something. We got a mic's falling. The mic's falling. 